Hello agents, welcome back to Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon Wildlands and playing hardball. That's our thermovision. Yes, we are beautiful. Even under these circumstances. So we are going to try out the uh, the rifle that we found over here where we get the laser 3 dot sniper rifle for the sniper rifle in Flor de Oro. Where we actually only need, to, it appears, we only need to do one more mission here. Where Baro will risk everything to see his daughter again. But before that we are going to do this one here. So, because I wanna see this M4A1 rifle in action a little bit. That we don't have any burst, burst, burst shots with it. Um, because I felt that the stats were a little bit better that way, but yeah, we'll see, so let's get this one going. Yeah, so this is, that's actually, they, they have a nice position here, but we can also do some pretty nice sniping from up here, I guess, however, there is no, there's no road. Okay, yeah, that's good. And maybe we should switch off our lights. Oh. Let's not break our rotors again. Oh, there's a... Yeah. Like this. In the darkness, they don't know what's going on. Did something break again? No. I'm sending the drone in. Oh, they have this beautiful attack helicopter. Okay. So it is a combat outpost. Guards the northern approaches of the MOB. We got some light panels here. Looks like most of them are actually sniper in the tower. asleep. Yep, sniper on the tower. That's our target number one. But don't shoot yet. Ah, this is ah, this is the the one where uh, that uh, where we can get into the underground compound, okay. Target number two is the guy with the minigun. Most of these guys will be sleeping now, I guess. I guess there's also... Oh yeah, there's... I don't know. Well, there is light. No, they didn't man... They didn't man everything, obviously, because it's night. So I guess they are low on manpower. Oh, okay, yeah. They, I think they are really low on manpower now. The baby makes three. Two more guys over there. There is some, someone sitting here, dozing on the chair. Another one dozing on the chair over there. Just spotted one with submachine guns. Enemy marked. Oh, and two guys are sitting here. Okay, so actually it's not sleepy sleepy time yet. Enemy spotted. Another guy. Oh yeah, that's the. the there's one guy apparently who's uh, patrolling around. Um, I want that guy I got to it. go. Moving to position. That's one last bad guy. Uh, what happened? Did you guys shoot the guy? Oh. Now he's walking inside. Well, that could come as a nasty surprise, I guess. Uh, are we actually in the right place? Yeah, we are. It must be in that building over there. Okay. What's the guy doing there? Oh, he's playing football. Oh, he's pretty good, actually. 
Yeah, a bit Get sad a that we are going to kill him now. Shit, I gotta find a good position. Got the target. Oh, let's, you guys take the heavy. I'm shooting this guy. Ready? Good to go. Three, two, one, shoot. Opening fire on these fuckers. That tank goes down. Suspected. Well, we can't shoot through the tent. Ah, oh, yeah, the guy is coming out now. There. Relax, we're still good. Yeah. So I'm not a fan of this rifle. <laughs> we could jump down and open a parachute, but I'm not sure if the parachute will actually open. So let's not do that. It would be quite cool. But uh, yeah. <laughs> let's not do that. We're landing the helicopter. There. Good to go. Yeah. Ready? Attack Open everybody. Fire. I called Pat Katari for some reinforcements. Copy, amigo. Sending you a fire team. I'm opening fire on these shitheads. They're Yo, alert. I got a weapons case here. There's a guy there. Yeah. Why is someone there? Didn't we shoot the guy? Well, anyway, so let's shoot the uh, generator over here. No hostiles evident. Tango down. Oh well, well maybe I just shut it down so not good. another Damn, explosion. Okay good. So we are in control. The rebels are in control. Gr guys grab their stuff, their ammunition and all their weapons. And our prize is here in the armeria. The armory. Good. Eh. Eh, no, that's not the right building. Oh, no, it was the right building. Okay, but they have it outside. Okay, what, what are you guys doing? Nice. And that's the laser three dots for the sniper rifle. That should be good. For M40. Oh, it's not for the M40. Okay. Oh, yeah, no, it doesn't have it. Okay. Well, but that's not our favorite sniper rifle anymore anyway. So where's the G28? That looks like a good thing. Yes. So that one is way more modern. Oh, it doesn't make a difference though. I wonder how it looks though. So this would be this is how it looks with the range finder. And the laser three dot. It, it doesn't make any difference. To me it looks like the same. I'm not entirely certain about the um Ah by B we can go Oh no it's always six times Yeah okay Was that different by the way let me just check this The range finder do we do we have a uh... It's also by B. Six time range increase. Yeah, okay. The six time zoom, I mean, of course. Sorry. So, okay, well, doesn't matter. Um, so, okay. I think we've, uh, we've tried out the assault rifle M4A1 sufficiently to know that I don't like it. We go back to our MK17, which also looks kind of cooler. Um, 
if a bit sturdier. And now, guys, you go and uh, you check you take one of the helicopters, and I am going to take a. Uh, the attack helicopter and then we are going for the general over there okay so um we are missing five kingslayer files now four skill points three accessory cases there's one here what's that actually a suppressor for the light machine gun okay but yeah i guess that's a machine gun that we are not using anyway Extended magazine for the sniper rifle. Who could that actually be for for the G28? I'm not sure what kind of ammo we are actually shooting. But it could be the 20. That would be awesome. So we are getting that one for sure, right? So let's get the helicopter. You other guys, you take a, a another helicopter and then we go in. So, but that concludes this episode. Thanks for watching, guys. This was Flor de Oro, the location combat outpost, where we got the sniper rifle. Yeah, and by the way, I want to check something. Which for which sniper rifle could it be? Yeah, no, it's just the three dot. Yeah. Uh, it was for the G28. Not sure here. This one is also... Isn't it? Isn't this a sniper rifle? Yes, it is. Yeah, let's check this one. But it's the worst sniper rifle. Yeah, it's more like... This one has more handling. And the range is... For a sniper rifle, the range is horrible. This here. It's horrible. Long barrel is better now. Long barrel... This gives more handling. I I'm not sure if it's if a long uh, if a, a foregrip is actually a good idea for a sniper rifle because usually you want to put it onto something, right? It's not an assault rifle, but I think like this this SRSA1 it's sort of a mix sniper rifle that goes into the direction of an assault rifle but in my opinion it's a flawed design because we can only do one shot with it anyway no yeah. it's super accurate though and i guess it does a lot of punch so let's compare it actually like to this one no the m40a5 does have more punch more damage or at least it's comparable and the G28 here. Yeah, I think the G28 is way, way better because it has such a higher rate of fire. Yeah, and, and the range, of course. So, so much better. So much better. All right, so this concludes this episode. Thanks for watching. We do have our very nice beautiful combat helicopter again apache like thing and then we are flying over here now yeah we are, we are doing this one who knows maybe so, maybe uh, something else is happening and might we might blow everything up i'm not sure but we need to reach the meeting point only reach not shooting up everything yet at least okay but then we will see in the next episode thanks for watching um, yeah, I would appreciate if you click the like button and subscribe to the channel so you never ever miss an episode again. See you next time. Bye bye.